Hi. I know this hasn't been as much fun as doing all of this stuff in the scenery studio, and believe me, I really wish you were here too. It'd be a lot more enjoyable to put your hands on the things themselves, uh, weld some things, cut some things, and get to know these tools and these materials. The last thing I want to show you is a key clamp fitting. So once we have metal units cut to length, we need to fasten them together, that assembly step. And with square steel tubing and those sorts of things, um, we're welding it or we're bolting it together, most often welding it. But with pipe, we have another advantage. We have the opportunity to use a fitting, something called a key clamp fitting. That's a brand name. There's also speed rail. Um, speed rail is more often used with aluminum. You don't really need to know that. The fittings can go on any particular length of pipe. The diameter, of course, is important. So these key clamp fittings that we have a bazillion of fit around an inch and a half um, diameter pipe, which is, in effect, almost two inches in diameter on the outside. Remember, the measurement on a pipe is taken from the inside of the opening. In order to attach the key clamp fitting to it, we need a particular tool. We need an Allen wrench, an Allen wrench, sometimes called a hex wrench too. This is a 5 16 inch hex wrench. It's also used for our um, rotolocks that we use to uh, tie platform edges together. We just tighten down that set screw. It's an Allen set screw. And we can attach pipes together to make railings. Uh, we can make towers. We can make structures that we can put platforms on. Use this in a variety of ways. Most often we're going to have to build in that triangle. If we build a structure of any magnitude, build in that triangle uh, to keep it all from collapsing to one side or another as a parallelogram will do. We attach that to the floor with a key clamp fitting that should be bolted to the floor. This is on a little piece of plywood just for illustration's sake. What's really important about this is that we've got a lot of force here. We've got a, a big lever, right? If this is just screwed into the floor, even with um, big old lag screws of some sort, uh, it's pretty easy to rip that thing out of a wooden floor or a platform. And so uh, I will usually put flanges in the floor uh, with bolts. These come in elbows. They come in uh, units that can swivel. So you can make uh, quite, an, uh, quite a variety of assemblies using pipe and key clamp fittings. A really uh, low-tech, high-impact, non-welding way of using steel to make to construct scenic elements uh, without having to go to the trouble of, of welding and having that kind of a shop for yourself. So there you have it.